All right, so this is a quick lesson for you. This is concerning a PC case fan that, you know, you come with a case. Uh, it's not necessarily the best fan in the world. This is out of my NZXT uh, 340 Elite, I believe. I've had it now for about, oh, going on three years in December here. So this fan has finally decided to quit on me. It is actually hooked up. There is power to this fan right now. I can feel, matter of fact, this is, getting pretty warm here where this is seized up this just happened a couple days ago but with these fans these these are uh, fluid bearing fans typically um, it's not the motor that's bad in them it's, it could be the fact that there's just no oil in it so you could peel these stickers right off and usually there's a little port right here that you that has a rubber plug that you can easily get out just by using something small like a little flathead or something and that will expose the motor in there you can see the motor you can see the shaft and the fluid bearing so what is uh usually the fix for this and this is something that i normally use for something like this is just some simple three-in-one oil it doesn't take much okay to do this and you could maybe get a couple drops in there we'll start with a drop first and see what it does all right so that's two drops and then we will go ahead and try to loosen this fan up see it turning uh oh see it look it hardly even doing anything just that oil releases that and gets that fluid bearing running again so this is something if you have a fan that's seizing up or you notice it's starting to slow down um this is something that you can try to fix up now you'll notice that as this uh the oil gets worked in there this thing will start to spin a lot smoother and this is exactly what it's doing here uh, so it does work really well for little uh, cheap fans like this. Um, and, it, it, yeah, even now it's just spinning faster and faster and faster as oil works into that bearing and gets in there. So, But don't do like what I've just done here and made a mess over the top of the fan because I'm going to have to clean that up. But uh, it definitely is uh, something that you could do to save a little bit of money. I mean, this is a $20 fix by simply going in and putting a couple drops of oil in this motor like this. So, anyway... That's all I wanted you to know about. So I hope you liked the video. If you did, then give it a like. We would appreciate the uh, support. And uh, if you liked it, subscribe and share it. Do whatever. So anyway, guys, thanks.